Well, African artists are experimenting with the genre of artists' books, while international artists are exploring African themes in their books. Viewers Caroline Turner has more. Artist Books in Africa is the first exhibit to focus on African artist books from the Smithsonian Libraries and the National Museum of African Art. Artist books are visual artworks that play with the format and push the boundaries. This genre has taken off in the last two decades. This one is called Egyptian Green, which is interesting because we don't think of Egypt as a green country. But the artist who did this, uh, Willa, uh, Willa Lega, who is um, British, sees the green in Egypt. The library has many books that are not under glass, which can be touched and held. These weren't always known as artist books. They were scientific books. What other mediums do you focus on? They would have this paper engineering that would recreate the solar system and so forth. But artists have also picked up the genre and have been able to do some very creative things with them. So that's a pop-up, grids of the city. This unusual book by Sudanese artist Hassan Musa is titled Application Zebra. He's done this whole calligraphy thing. And look here, you've got the, the leopard and its spots from fishes. It keeps morphing, here's its stars. It just keeps morphing into different kinds of things. It's like a Persian carpet. The more you look, the more you see going on in it. This is my favorite, the zebra. Moroccan painter Tufik Baramadane displayed his book of lithographs featuring whirling dervishes. I'm showing you my book called Nadine. So inside is a work about the dervish. It's a branch of Islam. It's a kind of sect. Only men are allowed to dance. The fact that it was also closed doors to, to the outside world. So it was kind of a secret word to me. What I wanted to try in this book is always what I try to do in my work, means to be creative. So when you look at the pictures, uh, all of them are completely different. An artist from Santa Cruz, Matt Cohn, created this handmade box to house the book titled Colored People, a compilation of photos by Cameroonian photographer Blake Jean Owen. He traveled there in 2005 and took over 100 photographs, fully immersing himself in the culture. And when he came back, he decided that he would select the people in the photographs and keep them in color and then he turned the rest of the information into black and white. So what you see here is the result of his efforts. We took these images and we realized that they would really behave and operate uh, in a meaningful way if we put them into the context of a book called Colored People. What you see here is this series of 20 images that we pared down from over 100. The images themselves, um, show a diverse range of different ages and genders and capture this true beauty of the color and the vibrancy of African culture. The exhibit is on display through September 11th. Books featured in Artist Books in Africa are from the permanent collections of the Smithsonian Libraries, Warren M. Robbins Library, and the Smithsonian National Museum of African Art. Carolyn Turner, VOA News.